happy tune. It, it is, and it's uh, 24 minutes after 7 o'clock as uh, we head into a holiday weekend. You can hit the road and uh, save a little bit on, on gasoline with this car from Ed Wallace. Well, good morning, Tim and Lauren. Yeah, we have the Lexus NX 300H. Now, we've already done the NX last December when it came out, and it was wonderful. In fact, my statement was, this is so good for so little money, I don't know why anybody would buy the RX model. Of course, they'll be updating that one later in the year. The question is, is this worth $5,300 more to buy the hybrid version? And that I'm not quite sure about. Now, here's what it's rated. It's rated 35 miles to the gallon in town, 31 out on the highway. In testing it this week, I got the exact opposite. I was getting 31 miles to the gallon in town, which is great for an SUV, and I was doing about 35, 35.5 miles to the gallon out on the highway. Here's the upside to this as a Lexus. One, it has magnificent handling characteristics out on the road. It is smooth as silk, but it doesn't float down the highway. Two, it's unbelievably quiet for this class of SUV. Now, when we did the other NX back in December, we did not have a two-tone dash, and I said one of the things that's gonna put people off is the dash comes so forward, far forward into the interior, it feels claustrophobic. You'll get used to it in a couple of days because you'll notice all of the controls in the center of the dash are right there at your hand. You don't have to reach out in order to switch the radio, mess with the navigation system, anything like that. In this two-tone version, it takes a lot of that perception of a very, very tight interior away. So I actually like that a whole lot more. Again, in the back seat area, it has a high roof line, so you can carry people in this vehicle five, six foot, probably six foot two if you wanted to, in the back at least, not the front. And then here in the back area, it's automatic. The button brings it up and down, reasonable amount of space, but it is a high carry up. Base price on this vehicle is 40,000. This one with everything on it's 50,000. Again, when you go to resell it, you'll get half the, half the hybrid cost back. And I'm not sure I would go with this, but I do believe the Lexus NX is the best of the compact luxury SUVs. With that, y'all have a good weekend. You can listen to Ed on 570 KLIF tomorrow's car column as always in Saturday's Fort Worth Star-Telegram. Thanks, Ed.